Hello MechWarriors, how's it going? And welcome to another episode of MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries. We are going stealthy today. We are going full commando with, uh, yeah, stealth armor on a mech. Hopefully not being seen by any enemies. And I want to use our archer hero to actually run the null signature system and see what we can do with that guy. The idea is to go solo into a mission. Hopefully we are not getting hit, not getting seen, and we can just go ahead and blast enemies apart. The idea is that we use our SRMs here which have a cooldown modifier of 35%, uh, but also 20% less damage. So we fire often, but we fire with less impact. It's gonna be interesting. So let's take a look. We are in a conflict zone right now. Also, we need money. We need money big time. That means, okay, before we go and build, I feel like we need to gather some items, some, some, uh, you know, uh, some money, most importantly. Okay. So let's go ahead, do that, repair everything. We will play a triple mission... Mission? Uh, is it triple? It's quad. Demolition patrol, targeted kill, attack and defend. Uh, it'll give us a crap ton of money though. I am going for it. Let's do it. We we'll, we'll go for a nice mix between salvage and money. So that we also can potentially get some because items, some good weather, things from the battlefield here. Anyhow, yeah, um, want to do it Central relatively thing. quickly so we can actually get to the build part of this whole thing as soon as possible. Four missions now, and then, um, yeah, rebuilding. And we are going to dive into another mission with our new hero mech. It's gonna be good. But I do feel like we this, this armor upgrade is gonna be very, very expensive. Uh, and we don't really have enough money to sustain ourselves for multiple months or, let's say, uh, upkeep cycles. It's, I think, 90 days here. It's not a month, it's 90 days. So, we need to gather some things before we can actually get there. Let's do it then. Let's go. The first mission here, by the way, it feels like... Uh, I think I saw it there. It was a very small map and we are playing Demolition here. So, we are going in, we're gonna flatten the base and we're gonna get out of there relatively quickly. And the other missions are also gonna be okay. Haven't been playing a quad mission in a while. But hey, the outcome, the monetary outcome, will be massive. Let's check it out. Lights on. I'm gonna play my Ultra Auto Cannon thing again, the Corsair. It's just fun. Especially in a small area. I feel like that's really good. Let's see. I'm also pretty happy that we fight um, some serious targets here. So we might find something that is worth picking. All right, yeah, so this is a very, very small map. We're also stuck on the stupid wing of the dropship. <laughs> come on, come on, we are not that big, right? Yeah, we can go through that. Cool. So 1,500 meters only. But I cannot really see the terrain because of the dense fog here. It's so crazy, isn't it? But I like it. I like the lighting of it, to be honest. Cool. So here we go. Wait, this is the demolish, uh, demolition, right? Not the other way around. Not a defense mission. All right. So first things first, we're gonna get the thing, and then we're gonna keep going. I'm kind of hoping that we get into a nice fight, and at the same time, I don't really want to get there because uh, repair. Yeah, repairing my max is not really possible between my missions that we have to play here. That's the base. Yeah, we can do it already. God, the velocity is just so bad still. Oh, man. Shouldn't really get in hot. So we need to stay cold when we engage. Right, shredding the base bit by bit. Okay, here we go. Panther. Actually, Wolfhound. Gone. Nice. Take the Edgar, I'll take the Commando. Or the other guys that are coming around here. Man, they're falling so quickly. It is a good mech. If you can manage it. If you can manage it. So 91%. We shoot the ring of this. The base of the of the orbital cannons. Makes them go boom faster. Okay. Run through here. 70%. These are not quite run throughable, right? Is that even the word? It's not. I know. 
Getting a little critical on the heat, though. But you know what? I really want to destroy these orbital cannons. Yeah, this is a lot of value. A lot of destruction value. There we go. Again, take the ring. Wrong. Like that. Alright, we got it. Cool. 19%. Heavy rifle, blackjack coming in. And more orbital cannons, so that's cool. Alright. Probably want to do this real quick. Again. There we go. 7%. And we're just gonna obliterate the little guy. And then overheat in the process. <laughs> yeah, our heat management is really bad. Getting hit now? By what? By you? Take that. Let's go, guys. You know what? We're just gonna run through some of these. Okay. Alright, facility cold means we can go, and I think that's exactly what we're gonna be doing. Ah, uh, hunchback. It's a nice build that you got there. Let's drop it. Uh, enemy dropship on us. Yeah, you know what? I, I think it's better to defend ourselves against these guys b before we go. Otherwise, they'll shoot us in the back with massive, massive force. Very important kill. The heat is on. Come on. I think I'm getting the hang of this guy, by the way. The more I play it, the more I get the velocity. And we are good to go. Let's run. You know what the mech needs? TS freaking M. That would be so good. Getting hot means we move faster. And this mech is, is so hot all the time. I should probably put it in the mech. Even, uh, even here in a, in a conflict zone, we can easily afford that, right? And we have one lying around. I know that. Okay. Okay, let's get out of here. Look at how somber this looks when we are not... Oh, interesting. Plant technology. Uh, when we are not going for uh, the other vision, the heat vision. Got that guy. All right, Lucas in the back. What's, what's, what's there? Do I care? I don't think so. I feel like we have some loot already with the Phoenix Arc. It's gonna be all right. Let's just go. Pushing, pushing, pushing! And here we are. Alright, first mission done. We took very little damage in the process, and that's because we overwhelmed our enemies with massive firepower. That was good. That was fun. But again, TSM would be so nice to be able to move around a bit quicker, switch to targets, and just push them when we are already in the middle of the fight. And we might even want to go for something like melee? I don't know. See, we got we got a long tom cannon. Who was running that thing? I have no idea. Cyclops Z or Z? No, Phoenix Hawk Clan. It is a good one. One, two, three, four, five, six. We are three picks too low to get this thing. Slick Speed is fantastic, by the way. I want that. This is a great opportunity to to use our cockpit. It gives us evasion and sensor range. And we rarely have a, a cockpit used so far. 3 TP. No. Panther, Commando. Uh, 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 uh. All of these are garbage. Lamb's battery pack. Land laser AMS. I'm gonna pick one. Because we wanna probably go for these. This is just money for me. How often would we see um, these... Phoenix Hawks. Worst case scenario is we're gonna sell the parts, so that's fine. There's nothing I need in this. Uh, I'm gonna take an SRM that I'm gonna sell. There we go. We dealt 3,800 damage. Sure, some of it is structural damage. A lot of it, actually. But still, that's such a high number. And we got 5 million Siebels out of that. Okay, so what we can do now is the following. I could click the repair button here, and there will be some time spent between this mission that we are about to play and the next one, so they could come out of repair in that time. And I think I should do it. Um, yeah. Yeah, let's do it just like that. We have other mechs that we can run. Okay. So, you're resting, and I think I want you to rest, so we're gonna take the Bravo Squad now. This is gonna be a patrol, so speed is kind of a little bit off the essence. We're gonna take the Partisan. Nice. Oh, we're gonna take um, 
Ugh, the boss head is out of action, sadly. Blood Asp is fine. This is a rather mobile mech. Uh, the Marauder is rather mobile. And we have a Stone Rhino with the Gauss. The Gauss Rhino. Right here. Could also take the Victor or the Timber. I think Timber is fine here. So, let's go. We'll take somebody who is proficient. You are. Blood Asp. Anybody? Uh, ballistics. You are really good with Ballistics. Ooh, you take that, and then somebody on the Timber Wolf. You're still resting, Bulwark. What are you doing here? Get out of here. Yeah, you are all resting. Doesn't really matter. Somebody do it like that. Okay. Second mission, two out of four, coming up right now. Patrol could be anything, by the way. We gotta go to a, um, a NAF point, and then things will happen. We don't know what it's gonna be. Lighting, man. It's so good. Let's do it. Hey, Commander. Welcome to the planet. Um, there's a patrol that we need you to go on. If you could just go to the nav point. Yeah, I'm running. And, I'm uh, running. You know, if you, if you find like a madman. Just, you know, take care of it. And uh, once you get back, um... Uh, uh, of, yeah, uh, well, we're, we're gonna do can it. Can I have your autograph? <laughs> can I have your autograph? <laughs> sure, you can have it. <laughs> alrighty, alrighty. So, 1100 meters. We are completely disconnected from the rest of the team. And I should disable hot seat now before my radical heatsink kit kicks in and is going crazy and destroys my internals. It's fine. Let's let's cool down. Give our team a little bit of time to catch up as well. Not that they can do it because we are still faster than with our nominal speed that we have right now. But anyway. 500. Here we go. We'll start at like 250, right? 100 meters? Alright. You're being hunted. Uh, survive for three minutes. Oh, that's a thing I can do. That is a thing I... Oh my god. Maybe I can't. Because lots of enemies. Okay, we want to take cover here. These are clan dudes. It's a shadow cat. Oh, oh my god. Oh, look at him. No, don't look at him. Because I want to stay in cover for the moment. Waiting for my friends. It is important. Bullets are already flying. Wait. Hold it. Hold it. What's the other guy? Clan Orion. Okay, we go in now. Hey, cat. Nope. Hey, what? No. Stay here. I know you got a mask. But I got a supercharger. And I also got a hot seat cockpit. I'll disable it again. No, we're gonna wait for the next wave to come. Actually, no. Let's rush him! And stalker. kill the stalker? Where did you come from? Oh, lagging. No, don't don't die on me, game. Don't die on me now. Okay, so the enemies are surrounding us. Let's go. Bam. Bam. Good, we got him. Next. Next is the whatever that is. A blood ass. Hot seat is on. Hot seat is kind of killing me right now. Ah! Orion, come on. Here we go. Bam. Flam. Bazam. Uh, actually, that's a lot of enemies coming up. Oh god, the hot sea cockpit, and I have to go there in order to get things done. What's that? Lots of funny enemies. I, I gotta disable hot seat. I need to cool it down. Let's go for this super freaking Nova. Wow. Can I have your mech, please? Hey, I want it. Yeah, you can tell we need the hot seat for extra damage. Ah, it's a cockpit hit. Oh. Yeah, you're dead. Ah, Madcat Mark II is getting... What? Uh, Marauder Mark II. Uh, Marauder II, to two see. Take that. Take that Warhawk. Ugh. Okay, the back is clear. Ooh, that was crazy. That was very, very close, actually. Still, there might be more enemies to come. Gargoyle, Warhawk, Supernova. Crazy. The Stalker now. I'm gonna go in again. Let's run. Oh man, I really hope my Marauder survives that. Mm, getting hit in the back is not good. Hello. Goodbye. Man. Don't you die? There we go. Bam. On the face. 
Yeah. Good. Still 13 seconds to survive this. 10. What happened here? He got obliterated almost. Grasshopper. Fine. Uh, I need to disable hot seat for a second. Let's get out of here. Where, where's the where's the evac? Oh, auto evac. Okay, good. I like it. Let's just run. This Marauder took more damage than it needed to. Mm. I mean, it's fine. It's fine. It didn't explode. And we can repair it. There's no big deal. Still was on its feet. Uh, that was kind of scary. At the same time, lots of clan technology here. Are these tier 5 weapons? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I was also on the wrong overlay here. Sorry for that. Uh, a gargoyle is a thing I don't want. It's very cheap. We can get these parts easily. Warhawk. 25 parts for a warhawk, but only 8 for a gargoyle. I don't get that. Do we take the ERPPCs? They are fan freaking tastic. If they are tier 5. Heavy large lasers, ER large lasers, Shadowcat, nice, Supernova. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna take a Supernova. I have no need for it, that's the thing. Would be fun, would be cool, but... I'm gonna take these PPCs in the hopes that they are good. Blood Asp Prime, Blood Asp A, Gargoyle. We can take the Gargoyle and just sell that thing, right? Or we do it the other way. And I'll take two ER Larges. The Heavy is also pretty good. But we'll go with this. Alright. So, two more picks. Two more Salvage Rights. Jump Jets. Class 1. Clan. Seems good. Seems good. Okay. So, that was that. Yeah, you leveled up your evasion. <laughs> a bit. A bit. Alright, continue. Mission number three out of four. Coming up right now. All of these guys need to be uh, put somewhere. Ah, yes. And some of the others are coming out of repair. That's good. Don't want to repair these right now. Maybe the Timber Wolf. And maybe... You, you'll probably take uh, five days. This might be still good enough. You're out. You're probably out. That's 11 days. We'll never finish that. It's okay. We keep going. We already got 13 million C bills. That's beautiful. Okay. Get out of here. We need a new set of mechs. We need a new set of pilots. Resting for two days. Sure. Cool. What do we take here? What are we playing even? Headhunting. Good. Targeted kill. Let's go. Let's go gaussing. We'll take the Gauss Rhino, we'll take the Cyclops. Let's go Atlas. Uh, Atlas is not possible. We can bring the Corsair back, but it wouldn't do anything. I want to go all long range here. So King Crab it is, and Dire Wolf is fine. Okay, slow and steady wins the race. Grid seems clear for now, Commander. Uh, resting, resting, resting. You're nice, good. Ready to drop. You want to be this guy. So back. And then we have... Yes, it's you. Alright, guys. Ready to go. Three out of four. Let's keep going. The money grab will continue. Cool. I like this mission. This is so fun. This whole multi-operation so far. It sets me under a little bit of pressure. So, that's for sure. But we are managing. This bounty is only payable if we bring the entire group to justice. Yeah. So you will have to search the area and ensure that everyone on our list is found and dealt with. Sure. Before I'm not gonna go in. straight ahead. Okay. That's not part of the base, but... Oh yeah, what, right. We also found these uh, weird uh, sliding jump jets thingies. Anybody there? I want to say hello. I want to trigger them so that they come to me. Locate and kill all targets. That's the thing I can do. Especially with this setup. 1200 meters. We're gonna go right into the belly of the beast. Right into the center and then we're gonna... Either go left or right. We'll see later. 1000 meters. I think at about 600 we know. There's a guy. 
Bourbon make R60. What? Got it. So Rihanna should tell us now ish if we are in the right spot or not. And I think it's about 600, which she's gonna say. Huh? 640? Ah. Uh. Yeah, we don't see our targets, but that's an Annihilator 2A with a lot of auto cannon twos. Let's go for it. I don't want him in my back. So we might as well take him. Stay on the high ground. I know that there's something on the right. But let's go for the jack. What? Jack down. Let's go for a headshot on the Annie. Nope. Nope. I cannot see anything. Okay. I think we got the headshot. Cool. So let's keep let's keep going. Proved heavy gals. By the way, what a beautiful biome. Uh, wait, we got it? Was that it? That was one of them. Probably the Orion who poked his head out. There's a guy behind me. There's a dropship coming. I know, I know, I know, I know. Nah, let's deal with the dropship before we do anything else. Cool. What's this? Uh, Vindicator. I'm still on the wrong overlay. I'm sorry. Here we go. Jenna won't die. Trees are my internal, my eternal enemy here. Kill. Headshot. Eh. Nope. Try again. Nope. I guess we got him. So, Jenner lost an arm, which is good. More people are coming, though. And part of our squad is already getting hit. Okay, you got this. I'm gonna go for him. On the hawk. It's a pretty decent hawk. The ultra auto cannon one. I like it. Okay, Avan Jaguar. Hell yeah. And he he doesn't go down. Night Star. God, they have all the goodies here. Speaking of predictive targeting, right? When the enemies are moving back and forth all the time like that, it's really hard to hit them. Now, back and forth. The Night Star, where did it go? It's like there? There it is. Headshot. Follow up. I'm aiming at center mass. Okay, we can go to pick up now. Oh, that's it. Uh, a little bit too easy, I guess, but I'll take it. Again, we want to get out here uh, in, a, in a decent amount of time, so we can play around with stealth armor. Let's go. I'm gonna keep shooting so that I get rid of the trees in front of me. They will only slow me down. And we have jump jets. I hope it's enough. Jump now. Warning. Incoming hostiles. Right. Got a crusader. Got the stupid mercenaries coming in. Obviously. I want a piece of the cake, but you know what? There's lots of cake for them. Comes in form of um, super high velocity slug shots. Come at me, bro. I mean, this mech is not really made for brawling, right? Please don't come at me. Mm, I don't like. This. I don't like this. Oh wait. Please. Uh, headshot. Yeah. Oof. Come on. Headshot. And headshot? Nah, no, not really. It's fine. So our evac has uh, shifted a little bit. We need to keep going. In the meantime, we're gonna take that crusader. All right, good fight. I was Don Rhino, probably not able to run the last mission, but the other guys are. So we still have a King Crab, we still have a Dire Wolf, and, and you know all the other guys. Bam, bam, bam! All right, God, I love this Don Rhino. This is so good with the turret mounts and the jump jets and the quirks and everything. It just gets the job done. No questions asked. It's just great. 
Just because I can. Let's wreak some havoc. We have a reputation to uphold, right? Let's go. Cool. Number three done. Number four coming up in a second. And again, we have great opportunities for good salvage here. There were some clan mechs on the battlefield. We saw an Ebon Jaguar. We saw a Hellbringer. What else was there? I mean, there was a Night Star. We get 10 mil out of that. Crazy. Continue. Okay, more Leopard Links. I don't know if I should just pick them to sell them. Also, this is a tier 5 Gauss, presumably. It seems good. It seems very good. Ryan MX. I don't care. I could take a Hellbringer part to finish a Hellbringer, so that's good. Also, LB5X clan, I'll take it, sure. Improved heavy gals, no thank you. You are over tonnage. Are you one of those? Don't think so. Nightstar, Banshee, Annihilator, Warhammer, Active Probe. We don't need more. Clan LRM10, beautiful. Tier 5 weapon, always nice to see. SRM2 is a thing I don't care about. I, don't, I need another ECM, so that's cool. Urban Mech R60. Got some heat sinks. Alright, I'm gonna take the Leopard Link to just sell that thing. It's very, very expensive. Zip, zap, done. Okay. So, last mission here. We have completed number three. Attack and defend. Oh no. I want a Rhino for this. I really do. Oh, Alright. Okay, Cyclops it is then. Okay, we, we need another set of pilots, I guess. I mean, not necessarily. We can keep those. But the Stone Rhino is too damaged to actually get on a battlefield again. We need long range in this mission. Good chunk of long range. The Lich is good. Alright, I'll take the Lich. Heavy PPC shenanigans might be good. King Crap is okay. Direwolf is okay. Cyclops is alright. Ish. Ah. I don't feel good with this, but I guess we'll do it. Resting is okay. Resting is fine. Okay, guys. This is it. This might be a bit more dangerous. Maybe I should have taken the Stalker for some arrow support while defending the base. At the same time, I could just set the, the Stalker in the base and just leave it there. With massive 3,000 meters range. It's just great. But hey, let's see what we can do. So, our Warhammer is not as good at killing enemies fast. It's only one base, though. That's good. I like it. As long as we don't get any kind of, like, VTOL swarm cruising in, we can just move towards the enemy base, destroy the Vanguard, destroy the base, and get out again. But, if something is coming, taking our base, we have a problem, because we wouldn't be fast enough to defend again. Let's see. Moving in. One inch at a time. It's the range on the base. We don't see it, right? It's a, it's a good 2,000 meters. Probably. I mean, the, the map in general is, is medium-sized. It's not too big. But it's just on the other side of the whole map. Got a friend with us. It's an Orion. That's good. Tank coming in, which is completely broken already. All right, and a patrol. Down. It's that Camera. That's fun. They're jumping around. I think I want to make my stand here for a second. That's an LRM down. Again. Beautiful. Take him. We can do it, guys. We can do it. Just waiting for the shot. But I don't know if I hit this or not. That's good. Side also down. Alright. Let's keep up with our push. Let's do it. Eh. Okay. I also want to destroy all of these turrets here because... First of all, they are shooting at us. And secondly, my friends might get distracted. Alright. Orion... What's your status? You got hit hard by some backstabbing. 
Rifle. Rifleman with the gals. And that's a Mad Cat Mark II. Oh my god. On the other side of the canyon, I don't really want to do anything against them. Cannot hit him. Not from here. No, I can. Guess we are in the fight then. Trying to just shoot on sensors is not easy. Got the rifleman. Here's the mad cat. Coming right at us. Now I'm hot. It's the drawback of the biome. There we go. Got him. So let's cool, 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 cool. Before we go further. We're almost there. We're almost at the enemy's base. I wonder though if they... If they have these... Um, crazy turrets. Okay, we're underwater currently, so we can afford shooting like crazy. Alright. So guys, coming around the corner. This is gonna be interesting. Headshot. Try again. Got him. Okay. Uh, guy behind us. Good reaction, thank you. That was great. That was really good. I was just an assassin, but anyway. We're gonna keep up. There it is. Yeah, this is so nasty. That that PPC turret is gonna wreck us if we don't do anything about it quickly. Stay in motion. And keep shooting. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. What's this turret? Small laser. Okay, we don't care. I missed him. Come on, guys. Where's the damage? There it is. Uh, stay here. Stay here. Stay here. Wanna wait for them to come to us. Us. Oh, follow me. Follow me, guys. I wanna pull back for a second. Come over here. We don't wanna engage that like that. Okay. Just a warrior. Just a freaking warrior. So here come the light max. Let's take him. Almost. Ah, come on. Miss links. There we go. Flying units. One, two. Nope. Need to manage my heat better. Ah, oh, and it's lagging. Okay, we go in with the lasers then. King Crab took some damage already. Is the tank behind us? Do we care? Feel like we don't know. He's a marauder. Can see him. There he is. Good. We'll go. Moving in on the target. Go for it, guys. It has heavy PPCs. Just like me. SRM tank. Tank down. Important. Uh, problem is we are getting mildly obliterated. My King Crab is taking more and more damage. And I cannot let that happen. I think something is shooting arrows at us. What was that? What was detected? Enemy dropship inbound? Um, uh, I'm not... I'm not feeling good. Thumper! Thumper artillery, that's the thing. Okay, got it. Where is the dropship? In uh, one minute at friendly base. Doesn't mean we gotta go back. Might. Might be. Took a good chunk of damage already. Come on. What are you? You're dangerous. That's what you are. You got lots of SRMs. Oh god, Brawler. Headshot. Almost got him. Very important kill. Uh, I honestly don't know if we should go back or not. I feel like we need to. What? What the hell was that, please? What again? What is going on here? Hello? Why? Okay. Um. Uh, back or not? Back or not? There's a dropship. We need to go. We actually have to do it. I don't like it, but I really... I think we need to. We have like a minute to get back to base. I mean, there are repair bays that we can use uh, fixing the king crap a little bit. Took some damage. <laughs> and in the meantime, my single assault mech friend at the enemy's base can deal with the base. Yeah, let's do it like that. Getting 
shot by something. It's fine. It's 2,000 meters. See, I don't want to lose the mission. That's the important part of this. There's one guy holding at the base. It's an Orion with an improved heavy gauss. It has some damage, sure, but it's a full dropship that's coming down in about two seconds. Target destroyed. Okay, guys, follow me. It's important. Gotta do it now. Allied forces have deployed Annihilator Max. Oh, these are the ones here, right around us. That's the dropship. We're coming! We're coming to help you guys. We destroyed the enemy's vanguard. You're gonna use your Annies to finish him off, I hope. Not only the Vanguard, but also the defenses. Let's see. My Warhammer also took a good chunk of damage already. So we probably want to put it in a bay as well. If they are multiples. If not, uh, I think the King Crab has priority. Little Sandstorm. Yeah, there's, there's fire going on. That's a Grizzly. A Cyclops. Good. I mean, our PPC turrets are also doing things, right? Well, maybe we shouldn't have gone there. But now that we're here, we're helping out. Yeah, we could have stayed, I feel. Hello, Grizzly. What about you? You're down. Basically. Alright. Yeah, we didn't necessarily need to do that. The turrets were still active. But hey, here we are. Oh, we got four bays. I'm gonna take one. Very good. Enemy by base is being destroyed by the Annihilators, so that's pretty good. We don't have to do it ourselves. We just need to ensure that allies are staying. We are not getting killed. Cyclops. Okay. Diable doesn't necessarily need it. I mean, I could go in there. Because I will never come back here. Right? Might as well use it now. King Crab, let's go! Very important. This is so damn important. Base is down to 85. Love to see it. Okay. But the longer we take, the more chances are that there will be more enemies to come. I want to go for the Warhammer again, and I will not put the um, the Dire Wolf in there. So nice. The wind pushing the dust around. So, what's that? An Atlas? It's trying to obliterate the base. We got some Annies. And I would say these are the biggest assets right now that are... Yeah, they're, they're getting it done. Base is down to 70. Mm? They're not doing it, really. They're still just moving and wandering about. The only guy that is attacking the base actively is the Atlas currently. Alright. Canyon? Yes or no? I'm gonna say no, we stay out of the canyon. It's not good to go down there. Stay on the high ground. It's good ground. Alright. So, in general, I'd say we have this mission in the bag. What's that? Weird texture. There doesn't seem to be any more enemies in the base. If there's anything, then it will come from the outskirts like a dropship, like a flying swarm of VTOLs, maybe? But again, the base is dropping massively. We are already at 61%, and we certainly get this done. Okay. It's the base. We see it already. Cannot deal damage to it. New target catapult. That's why the Annihilators are not joining the fight. They found an enemy, but they cannot get to him, right? More or less. I don't care about the cat. You can have it. I care for the base. Target acquired. So village and his little friendly minions. Light mech coming up. The spider 5v. Almost got his leg. Got his leg. Nope. 
Drop the mech. Better. Yeah, lots of turrets still here. LRM turret. We have AMS, don't we? Um, this is irrelevant. That's a tank. Why not? Why the hell not? That's why not. We don't hit him. Cool. Yeah, it's time to crush that base. Here's the tank. He's always behind something. Got him. 45. Very good. I think we have the turret. Looks like it. So 38. Annihilator now wrecking things as well. Oh boy. The base is gonna fall. Okay, yeah. Whatever. 31. Just crush everything. See them driven before us and hear the limitation of the mech techs. Not killable. This is 24. Yeah. 19. Oh, that's quad PPC. Can we quickly take that down? Please. Somebody. There we go. 6%. 1%. Done. Destroy Hardened HQ. Good. That is number four out of four. I'd say it was pretty good. And going back was maybe the right call because we also minimize our repair cost at the same time. So that's cool. What are you? That's treasure, sure. Ah, oh, beautiful. So, now, we finally have enough money to start the build on the Archer to make it invisible to the enemy sensors, hoping that we can just move around unseen and just blast the enemies apart with SRMs. I don't know how good it's gonna be. The last time I encountered one of these stealthy mechs, my friends were not shooting it. Because they could probably not see it. We'll check it out. Maybe the enemies still see us because we are, you know, the main guy here. And somebody has to shoot me, but we'll see. Alright. So. We are... Picking what? Probably mech parts or clan stuff. Why am I already here again? I, I need to go... Ah! <laughs> okay, Mad Cat Mark II. Yes or no? It's a beautiful mech. But I don't necessarily need it. Marauder. I'm gonna say no to the guy. Cooling lines. Ooh. Ooh. Two and a half tons for 20 heat capacity and 1.3 heat efficiency. That's good. That's a good item. Cyclops. SRM6 clan. Ah, it's good. The Grizzly? No quirks, though. No quirks on the Grizzly. Weird. Catapult K2. Also, a no for me. It's not compatible with any of the catapult parts that we have. The PPI cat. Another LRM10. Yes, please. Thank you. Ballistic fire control system. Nah. Mistlings. Also, nah. Power sensors. They're good. They're alright. It's a good item to have. Improved sensors. No. Ah, so, again, nothing that we technically want, so we're gonna go with the things that make sense. I could just take two XL engines and sell them. And that's exactly what we do. Alright. The Bounty Hunter. Oh, how the mighty have fallen. It was once a time when the members of the Blackhearts were the most feared people in all of human space. I was Cameron's anti-terrorist unit that f uh, used fear and terror tactics themselves to pacify anti-league upstarts in the periphery, often using advanced power armor very similar to my own. But when the House Cameron fell, so did the Star League government that employed and protected these self-righteous hitmen. With no friends among the great houses and many members fleeing accountability with Kerensky and his lot, those that remained turned to the mercenary life to survive, scrounging for work and money from the very people they once would have hunted down. Ain't karma a bitch. I accept. Okay. So, we got money. Got 37 million sea bills. Love to see it. And we're gonna go to an industrial hub and build an archer with missiles. Let's do it. And stealth armor. I'm taking the archer specifically because I think we can make something mobile out of that. 
want to go and, and do some hit and run shenanigans with this. L let's repair everything. And in we go. Could have also taken the Sidewinder. That's not the Archer. Hello? That's the Archer? Yeah, there we go. So... Ah, it still was in an okay active state. That is good to know. Composite and Pharaoh. Ugh. Has one speedy leg actuator. <laughs> oh wait, no, we need that ECM, never mind. Uh, revert. We want to drop the Pharaoh armor because we need stealth armor. Oh, it's on armor, obviously. It's not. Null signature system. How do we... Uh, it's just three critical slots. ECM already installed. Interesting. Oh, wait. I thought NSS was armor upgrade. I guess it's not then. Um, and yeah, we have a bit of uh, tonnage problems now. So that's a thing that we need to fix. How do we fix it? By dropping this. And by... I guess dropping these. Uh, let's see, what are our options here? We have some ASRM6s, tier 2. Do I want ASRMs even? Or do I go for clan SRMs? Just full on master blaster, fight everything with massive firepower. These are lighter than the ASRMs. But ASRMs are really, really good. Um, also, do we need Harshal in this uh, instance? A and uh, we, we can keep the Pharaoh, right? That's right. Okay. Let me think. I want to do it like this. Uh, Proto heatsink goes somewhere. Cool. The heat bank. Probably need it. Our cooling is garbage. Actual garbage. Holy crap. Why is that? We are running a radical PDHS. Huh. Alright. So... How much ammo do we have here? We still have some double bins. That's great. So we drop the half tons. Get out of here. Uh, need another... Why is the proto not helping? Oh, it is helping. But it's just not good. Well, 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 well. Radical PDHS. What about a uh, clan double heat sink kit? Let's take all of these then. Hello? This is not really getting anywhere. No. No, no, no. We need that radical one. Okay, proto heat sinks. We have a bunch of them though. So, 6.0 against 2.2. .2. Ah, wait. We have an exchanger, right? Yes. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Getting there. Still a build that is a bit all over the place. We're running 79 kph, which is great. I wonder if I need Harshal on this. This could be tarnished that I don't... I don't need. Weird. Weird, weird, weird. Um... I guess we have to drop this... 4-rated weapon. This is a test run. Okay, let's call this a test run, all right? We want to try... Uh, we want to see if the Null Signature system is actually actively helping us. Heat management support is fantastic on this. Uh, we want advanced missile. We don't have advanced missile. That's all right. It feels bad. <laughs> this thing is five tons, which is super heavy. Uh, okay, I'll try it. Without Harshal. Let's go. Let's do it like this. Get some ammo in here. Do we have enough? I wonder. Do we have enough? We have some extra tonnage again. So I'll bring back the... I should probably just run uh, Clan SRMs here, by the way. Um, which I could. I could do that. Easily. Double bin in here. And 
Another single bin. Such an all over the place build. But I feel like it's good. Marshall in the center. Drop it. We don't need it. We are invisible, right? Right? <laughs> Maxed out armor. Uh, uh. Can we have some hardened upper arm? Helping us out a little bit. Weapon mount heat. No. Doesn't really help that much. Let's change our heat bank. I mean, the bank is somewhat helpful. What about these cooling lines? Uh, that is amazing. Two and a half tons though for two slots. One ton. Cooling efficiency modify. Ah, wait. These are different ones from different mods. Interesting. Two tons for pretty good efficiency, actually. How to do it. We don't do it. We give it... I don't know. Lower arm. Actuators. I don't need anything like that. Weapon mount heat is, is a thing I could take, but it eh, doesn't feel good. Okay, I'm gonna try it like that. It's fine. It's perfectly fine. We are a bit under tonnage, but that doesn't matter. We're gonna start the build. I want to see if we're getting hit or not. So, let's find a mission. Any mission is good. Scorched Earth. Yeah. Alright. Let's do it. Let's scorch the Earth. And here's the thing. I will bring the Archer. I will also bring a good chunk of support. But I will tell the supports that I don't want them to interfere. I want to see if I can make it happen myself. Play Scorched Earth. Yes. Uh, oh, a bit of salvage here. Why not? Okay, let's go. Cool. So Warhammer out. Archer in. And the same squad. It's fine. 42 days. I don't care. I want to see it on the battlefield now. Is stealth viable? Yes or no? That's an answer that we will figure out after this mission. I guess it's no. We'll see. We'll see. Also, do I have to... Activate it or is it automatically activated? I don't know if this is, is this a toggleable, toggleable item or not. So many questions. I'm super excited to see what's gonna happen on the battlefield. Yeah. Here we go. And I can already feel like this is not gonna work. There we go. So. We have the SRMs on the arm, we have the ASRMs on the torso. I think, uh, ultimately, this guy wants just clan SRMs. And just Master Blast everything. Uh, in the nighttime. Incoming transmission. Commander, our mutual employer has sent us to reinforce you. Lead the way. Okay, that's the awkward. Will the oh, we got two different SRMs from different mods and... One of them has ammo, one of them doesn't. Ah, yes. Okay, so I have to do something about that. Fine. Hold your fire, guys. But come with me. So yeah, one of the SRMs wouldn't work because of different mods. Ugh. I said hold fire. Oh, yeah, we have these mercenaries now. Uh, that I cannot direct. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. More tanks. It's completely ignoring me. So far. Huh. I didn't get hit once yet. I didn't get hit once. Yet. Now I'm getting hit. Okay. A little bit. Take a bit of damage. Jammed. I'll spawn. He ignores me. He completely... Oh, no, he doesn't ignore me anymore. <laughs> alright, alright. You take the spider. I'll take the tank. Yeah, people are attacking me now. Got him. But you can see there are things flying around like the PPCs. They don't hit me. They just don't hit me. 
that out of the sky. That out of the sky. It is working? Consider me surprised. That's really good. I, if that's true, I'm gonna go stealth on everybody. That's insane. Uh, I, I'm baffled. I am actually baffled. Again, we don't really know because we have some friends around who we'll also take some damage. Uh, let's take all of this. Ha! Huh. And the skirmish was relatively quick. Maybe that's the way. Just go stealth on everybody and not get hit ever. Okay. Yeah, we're done. This is it. This is just it. 3%, whatever we have here, we're gonna destroy it. Uh, quick mission. Pretty quick mission. Where's Evac? To the left. Cool. I wanna skirmish a little bit more. I wanna attract fire from uh, this year charger. Come on, shoot me, bro. Fight me. I only got small lasers. Yeah, that's fine. Come on, fight me! Completely ignores me. Completely ignores me. But what happens if everybody is stealthed? What then? I mean, they're currently going for a target that they can see. Will we all be ignored or will somebody get attacked then? Got him. Got him, got him, got him, got him, got him, got everybody! Good mech. Also, uh, wrong overlay. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. Uh -huh. Let's go to evac. This is viable. This is really viable. And I'm happy. I'm happy that we tested this. Yo, this gives options and a lot of them. Holy macaroni. What I don't like is the different ammo types and different weapon systems here. So they technically are called the same, but you know, one of my SRMs is not able to fire because coming from another mod. What are you? Burke? Right. And yes, we have a good chunk of DPS on this guy. Heat is well, somewhat manageable. Can pump some alpha strikes out. Oh, dropship coming in now. I wanted to fight those guys again. But I guess we'll take it. This is a game changer for me. The fact that the enemies don't attack me that they go for the other guys, although I have so much aggro blast on them, makes this super interesting. We should get more stealth now. Super duper good. Goody. So, let's continue. The Blackhearts love me. I'm gonna take the engine. I'm going to take an ultra auto cannon. Or, oh, wait, auto cannon. Three more picks. LRM 10. It's good money. None of these guys matter, right? Ah, not really. Okay. So, we, we did it. You dealt zero... Yeah, you dealt zero damage because I gave you the don't attack order. Sure. Oops. <laughs> That's great, guys. I love it. If you love the video, then don't forget to leave a rating. Seriously, I, I'm kind of bound to your help here. So help me out with the algorithm a little bit. And if you want more of this, uh, subscribe to the channel. And I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.